Hi there, this is Asaf from Opinion Stage. In this short video, I'll show you how to use the Opinion Stage WordPress plugin to create beautiful and engaging surveys. Let's get started. I'll start by going to the plugin repository and searching for Opinion Stage. And once we see it, we install it and then we'll activate it. And when we activate the plugin, we'll reach this screen. In this screen, I can either log into Opinion Stage if I already have an account or create a new one if I don't. Let's say we don't have an account yet. So let's quickly create an account. And once we have the account, we'll ask, be asked a few questions to optimize the experience that Opinion Stage can offer us. What do I want to do? Let's say gather leads. I want to improve, let's say, internal communications. And let's get started. Now you'll see a screen with all the different formats Opinion Stage offers. In this video, we'll focus on the survey. You can either create it from scratch or from a template. Let's say we want to create it from a template to make things easy. So we'll reach here the template repository. And like you can see, we have hundreds of different templates we can choose from. Let's say we're looking for a feedback survey. We'll just search for feedback survey. And we can see we have a few options. Let's say we want to try this one. Let's just kind of scroll through it to see that we like it. Like you can see, the answers here can be very visual, very engaging. You have close-ended questions and also open-ended questions. You can integrate a lead form inside, ask different questions about the user. And at the end, say thank you and then you have a call to action as well to lead to the next action you'd like the customer to do. So let's say I like this template. Uh, I'm going to click Use Template. What that will do will copy this template to my repository. And then I can make all the changes I like. I can change texts, remove images, add, add more questions over here. Um, there's the closings that I can edit. I can integrate a lead form, as I mentioned. We have skip logic, uh, logic jumps if you'd like to do. We have a lot of different settings. And then just to mention, you can also design it the way you want with your own color theme, font, uh, social integrations if needed. And you can also forward all the information to your marketing automation if you like. So let's say we finished working on the survey. We're going to publish it. After we publish, we can also preview to verify we like it. And then we want to add it to our website. So let's say I want to add it using a short code. I can just come over here copy the short code and put it wherever I like in the WordPress site. But the easiest way to do that actually is to go to our article. In this case, our article is written in the Gutenberg editor, although you could also do it with a classic editor. I'll show you in a moment. Um, and let's say now that I'd like to add this just uh, under here. Uh, let's see. So I'll search for the survey and here is our survey. And now I'm going to look for the survey. Here it is. And just insert it, click update to the article, and you're done. Let's just lay, let it save and take a look at the article with the survey. And here's our survey. Voila. Now, let's say I want, I am using the classic editor. In this case, we'll just create a post in the classic editor, and I'll show you how you add the survey to that editor. You'll see that on the top of the editor, you get this button, you just click it. You'll see the same um, window you saw before, and you can insert the item. You can also put it on your sidebar, just uh, go to the appearance widgets. We have a special opinion stage widget for that. And that's it. As you can see in this very short tutorial, opinion stage is very simple to use but includes a lot of features and capabilities, and the surveys look great. Hope this was helpful and enjoy the plugin.